These are honey mushroom, Almula leucolica. Left some patchel wells over here. Inside is white. It's really foamy. Like a These are honey mushroom, Almula leucolica. This mushroom gonna grow on the ground. This is not young. This is the young one. You're gonna see some vein at the bottom. The top is kind of like a hairy. In my area, based on my experience, I found three different kinds of honey mushroom. Ringless honey mushroom, Amelalia tabescens, Amulalia mela. This one has a ring, and today I'm gonna show you Amulalia gallica. This is the area that honey mushroom grow. Amulalia gallica. This is the deadlock. Honey mushroom Amuralia gallica is different from ringless honey mushroom Amuralia tabescens or even ring honey mushroom Amuralia mela. This one they are growing on the ground. This one they are growing on the ground, scattering and growing a single one. They don't grow as a cluster like ringless honey mushroom. They like to grow in the cold area like late fall to early winter. These mushrooms they are contain cobwebby or patio well. This one it look like it look like a cotton over here. That's happened because when they're young, these patio wells cover the immature spore so that they can develop. And once they grow, they, they open and leave some patio wells over here. This mushroom have white spore print. The top of the mushroom look like a hair. The bottom part is a grill mushroom. It's a grill. They have patio well over here look like a cotton the stem of the mushroom is swollen if you cut half inside is white
This is how the young one look like. It has the partial veils, cottony cover over here. Uh -huh. The cottony or the cob baby is a cover the immature support for their development. When they mature enough, they're gonna open, then the partial veil gonna break and it's gonna leave the partial veil over here. It's hard to see this one. It's like this. It's my first time to eat this mushroom, so I'm gonna try in small amount. I think it is enough for me for the first time. So I'm going to wash this mushroom first in warm water and you can see that the top of the mushroom kind of slimy, kind of slippery. All kinds of honey mushroom behave similar way. They are slimy when washing. Not everybody can consume these mushrooms. You can, it can cause stomach upset. So a lot of people recommend to broil it for a long time before consume it. This is after I boil for 15 minutes. You can see it is kind of foamy here. It's very foamy. Like a dishwasher. <laughs> Even the soup is kind of thick. It smells very very good. The color of mushroom get darker. Kind of like turn black. Kind of darker compared to the fresh one and the soup very thick now thicker <laughs> you can see now after i broil for 20 to 25 minutes the mushroom get darker after cook this is the soup kind of thick so after this I'm gonna wash with water one more time this this soup I'm gonna I'm gonna get rid of it oh. 
after I cook, then I wash with water one more time. The mushroom less salami. It's not salami like earlier. It's better. <laughs> It's very yummy. I love it. It's a crunchy, tender, sweet. It's not very sweet, but it's like mushroom sweet. Very good. Merry Christmas and Happy Holidays. Don't forget to click like and subscribe to be my friend. See you next time. Bye-bye.